and welcome back to another video. I feel like we should be starting off with Callie, but um, Eric was looking so beautiful I couldn't help myself. Um, <laughs> but welcome back to another video, and um, even though I... Oh my gosh! The timing! I just loaded in! I I didn't plan that at all, by the way. Um, <laughs> I didn't plan that. <laughs> the timing, though. We're gonna start a university playthrough. Ta-da! <laughs> oh my god. Oh gosh, that really got me. Um. Well, welcome to the new series. I was gonna talk about it a little bit more but here we are we're gonna be starting university soon um and callie got um accepted which is freaking awesome um <laughs> we're gonna be starting university playthrough which means we won't be focusing on this household anymore um but i did want to say um i did give the whole family a makeover i i actually so what happened was i think i may have said this during the build video but i had played up to episode nine and then i completely lost all of that work so all of that stuff was gone so i had to start um from around episode seven um so the house was saved, so I got up to the point where I built the house, but everything after that was just completely gone. Um, so I've had to play up to this point again, and Callie just aged up. And um, now that she's aged up, I wanted to start on a university um, playthrough. I was thinking about possibly having her stay here for a while, but I think it would be really fun to just jump in to um Callie's new journey um and to like you know show that she's gonna start a new journey I not only gave um Eric um and Alyssa a makeover um Autumn aged up she's just sleeping right now she is just a little angel though she's so cute um I gave Autumn a little makeover well she aged up so I gave her a makeover um also I will show Callie in a second, but I, I really want to show this off. Um, look at this man. He cleaned it. He, I wanted to kind of like revert him back to how my initial goal was to kind of get him back into a place where he was um, before uh, the when he was like, you know, still working and stuff and like in the business career. And so I, you know, cleaned up his beard. I, um, his hair is the same. I gave him all new outfits. He's looking very cleaned up, very like, um, just like ready to go. And he is a little bit more casual than he used to be. I, when he was younger, he definitely was like suit and tie every day, um, button up shirt all the time. So he's a little bit more laid back than he was before, but he is kind of getting back to that again. Um, and then, last but not least, um, Callie has a huge makeover. I had so much fun with this. The, the god rays are really... <laughs> but look at her. She, she's looking kind of upset right now, but she's all aged up and she has a complete new makeover. And so what I did, um, so I think... In the actual playthrough, I gave her the outgoing trait. What I did instead was the party animal trait. So what I'm going to be doing, I'm going to be having her be a party animal while she's in college. And then what I think I'm going to do is once she graduates college, we're going to change that into the outgoing um, personality trait. Just because, I don't know, I want her to have a lot of fun while she's in college. And I think this would be a great time for her to really delve into that um i genuinely was not expecting um i wasn't expecting to 
get right into the acceptance letter this quickly. I wanted to spend some more time here, but it seems like we're going to be moving on pretty quickly. Um, I also gave all of her close friends makeovers. I gave Molly one. Um, not a huge one, just a small one. Um, I aged her up. And I also um, gave Kaysen a makeover. So we'll be seeing him around. Um, he's looking very handsome. <laughs> he's looking very handsome. Um, and then I gave Molly a makeover as well. Um, but yeah, so I think... Um, Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm kind of floored everything happened so fast. I was intending on um, being home for a little bit longer. Um, but before we go, let's just pack up all of our stuff. Oh my gosh. I wish we could put her computer in her inventory, but unfortunately we can't. Um... I wish we could put this in our inventory, too. Dang, man. Her computer would be so nice to have at school. Look at this thing. But with that, I think we're... Oh, actually, I think we can do it from upstairs. We're going to enroll in the university, which is so exciting. Holy crap. Um... It's finally time for Callie to move on to the next part of her life, and um, we're going to go with a fine arts degree um, in Brightchester. And we're going to... Excuse me. We're going to um, live in the dorms there. I, I debated working from home, but I think it would be best for her to go to school, and it, I have some things in, in store, so... Um, <laughs> I'm rather excited. So we will be going to the fine art. And we'll be taking three classes with no elective because these, I feel like classes are just so much work. We're going to be going to Wyvern Hall. Yes. Um... Her dad would totally pay for the uh, class, by the way. I, I <laughs> Household funds would definitely... Um... <laughs> and then I think he's going to send her over with like 5000 or so. And... Oh my gosh. <laughs> Off we go. And we're back. Um, I, I did a little bit of work behind the scenes, but we're finally at university. Um, Molly should be here soon. I did add her as a roommate, so hopefully she will be lit moving in here soon. Um, and I'm just really excited to be going to school with Molly with her best friend. And um, I of course picked the best um room um in the in the house in the in the house. I picked this room. Because why wouldn't I, you know? Like, hello. Um, all pink, and it comes with an ensuite, so... Couldn't help myself. <laughs> what the heck is this ketchup thing? Some other person tried to claim this room before me, and I just wasn't having it. That's why, um... <laughs> That's why there's ketchup and stuff in here. Um... But yeah, we're here. Um, she's playing with some random guy right now, but I don't know. I'm what do you even do when you I, I say as if I have never been to university. <laughs> I have been to university. I I just kinda hung around in my room the whole time on the first day. Um So we have a term paper. A presentation and a final exam. Okay. Um, for right now, let's come upstairs and do a painting. Um, I wish that like when you went to uni, like one of your parents would like 
your parents could like come along with you, you know? I think that would be really cute. Um, let's put up our pictures. I wish I could go into build mode because this is really awkward. Let's not put up selfies of ourselves on the wall. <laughs> uh, it's a bunch of selfies of Callie. People are going to walk in her room and be like, oh my gosh. <laughs> She's so obsessed with herself. I mean, she kind of is. But, oh my gosh, to celebrate being in uni, we need to take a selfie. I mean, do you see her new look? She's freaking, oh my gosh. She, I gave her a makeover. And when I was done, I was like, who is this? <laughs> I don't know who this is. Is there, I wonder if there's a social bunny post we can make. No, there's not. Okay. Also, I wanted to say, Kaysen's been sending us really mean text messages lately. <laughs> um, like, I don't really know what's going on with him. Honestly, I think it's just like a, um... You're moving on with your life and like you're being so successful and i'm meanwhile i'm here left behind and he hasn't really done anything yet and so he's feeling a little bit jealous and maybe upset with her but like that's not her fault she's just i don't know she's just moving on and trying to be successful and i don't understand what his issue is oh she's so cute I what these ones look like. Oh, that's cute. Also, I've never had a sim that pulled off blue lip gloss so well. I couldn't ever pull off blue, blue lip gloss, but look at her. She looks freaking gorgeous. Also, I have the need to give all of her roommates a makeover. Um, so I will do that off camera. I just cannot be living around di the hell? I cannot be seen living around a bunch of CC disasters. <laughs> it's it's not a look that I'm into. <laughs> what the heck is happening here? Well, I think in the meantime, I think we should go somewhere. Um why is our mom here oh don't tell me our mom is in Yvette and my mom is here oh also I wanted to let you guys know um there's like the tiniest bit of romance between Yvette and Eric um he like ended up flirting with her while um he was out at a cafe so the spice is here you know <laughs> this spice, the spice is here. Also, I hope that I downloaded um, the mod that makes homework go faster. Give me one second. And we're back. We are at Pepper's Pub with Molly. I don't, I'm not sure where she's, oh, she's just going inside. Um, I downloaded one off of the gallery. Um, oh, it's just so cute. I think it's, it might be a little bit too big for my tastes. I, I really like big beautiful lots um but they do tend to get a little bit cluttered and a little bit hectic when there's too much to do so we'll we'll kind of see what happens um with this one and if i change it i change it um oh look at her busking um but i just wanted to come here with um my bestie and we're just gonna like hang out or do drinks together um just kind of talk about finally going to uni um because i don't know it's a big move and at least she has her bestie with her to go um girl you act like you just bought like six people drinks you just bought you and molly drinks don't front <laughs> who is this oh i think this is one of our roommates I'd give her a makeover. I could give her like a Barbie look. I think that'd be really cute. 
I love you, Sue. He's just like, yeah, kaysen has been, like, being really rude to me lately, and I don't know why. I just am trying to move on and, you know, become a new person and try different stuff, but... She's probably checking her phone to see if he texted her again. And she's just like, you know, I just don't really know what to do. Where is she going? Where are you going? Are you cleaning dirty? Di you know, I can't have a single moment of peace with you, Callie. You're so, you're so cute, though. I think if I met Callie, like, in real life, I'd have the fattest crush on her. <laughs> no joke the fattest crush i'm surprised i mean i don't know if i was molly i would have had a crush on her honestly like i wouldn't have minded molly and her getting together but she just never really had a thing for callie so i just didn't go down that route i don't know where molly went uh I was planning on, you know, being out for a little while, but I don't know where my bestie went, so. You know what I forgot is a thing? Oh, she left. That's why. That's why we can't see her. <laughs> That's why we can't see her. <laughs> so, Callie decided to invite Kaysen over and bring him to um, one of the football games. And while she's doing that... Um, I think she just kind of wants to make sure that he doesn't feel, you know, ostracized or, oh my gosh, this whole camera thing is driving me absolutely nuts. Um, she doesn't want to make him feel ostracized or, like, alone. Um, he was feeling sad when he got here, so... Um, also, I'm so sorry about the awkward um, camera angles. She invited him to the bar, but he wasn't really um, doing very well when she got there and she was gonna argue with him but and just be like why are you being such you know like an a-hole to me and sending me mean text messages all the time um but she kind of decided against it we're gonna work from home today um just because she didn't want she didn't want to make the situation worse she said that she missed a party um, but what I was going to do tonight was I was going to throw a party in the dorm. It kind of depends on what time the football game ends. Um, but she's in there right now with him, and he's still in a bad mood. Also, um, since he's here... Uh, this is his uh, makeover. He's looking <laughs> as gorgeous as ever. Um, <laughs> I gave him some tattoos too. He had tattoos when he was um, in his first... Um, the first time I made him, he had tattoos. and that, So I just kind of gave them back to him. But she's just kind of like, hey, like I, I don't know what's going on with you, but you know, I'm hoping that you're not mad at me. He's high maintenance. I didn't know that. I made him. I didn't know that. And she's just gonna be like, I just, you know, I don't want you to be upset with me. I love you a lot, and I don't know why you've been acting like this lately. So they're just gonna, oh, she's gonna give him a kiss. So they're just kind of figuring it out and talking through it and feeling flirty because they're around each other because they like each other a lot um so let's hope that today's little date um help their relationship a little um i really hope it did because i i don't want them to go through a really big rough patch i say as i'm tipping my fingers together evilly um <laughs> but in the meantime i think i want to throw a party <laughs> and with the keg tapped the party is on um i'm so excited oh it says it's not tapped i thought it was tapped it's literally tapped miss ma'am everything okay 
All right, let's fill some cups with beer. Um, also, this is her new party wear, and it's it's giving it it it's so good. Um, I really like the um. Some of her new outfits are just so iconic. <laughs> I love them so much. Um, I want to do a keg stand with Molly. Where is Kaysen? I invited him. I don't. I'm not sure where he went. Um, and I, it seems that only Savannah showed up to our party. I invited everybody, so... Well, they're all down here. Okay. Okay, I just had to make sure, you know. I, I didn't want people, um, missing the party. Um, but we're about to drink a lot, have a lot of fun, and... <laughs> and guinea pigs are going crazy in the background. And I wish there was... I think I've said this before, but I wish there was, like, a call to drink, um, button on here. <laughs> so you could all drink together. Keg stand. Keg stand. Oh, she a real one. Oh my gosh. A successful keg stand on your first go? Hot damn, baby girl. <laughs> Kason's just over here on the computer like holly man oh she's so cute also I had Mol I gave Molly an outfit that matched um Callie's because hello why wouldn't I oh she's already drunk <laughs> Oh, it's bad decision time for real. I'm just kidding. We won't make any bad decisions yet. Not yet. That's for later. Bad decisions are for later. I say as she sits next to, like, literally the most beautiful girl here. Holy crap. Bridget, no! Don't go that way! I don't want to flirt with you in front of Kaysen. She's like, oh my gosh, thank you so much for coming. You look so nice tonight. Wait, 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 wait. She's gonna be like, oh, thank you for coming. You look really pretty tonight. Like, you look really, really, really pretty. <laughs> and, like, really hot. But, like, you always look, like, really hot and pretty, so. <laughs> if they just stop staring at each other. It's the frozen dead eye stare for me. The unblinking. <laughs> I wonder why she's feeling flirty. She hasn't drank anything yet. I know Callie's drunk though, so. Kaysen won't even leave this room. He's just over here i wonder if everyone else is just upstairs johnny's upstairs um ash is upstairs what is where where is everybody and it seems that across the room there callie seems to notice someone that is really cute and in her drunken state she's like oh <laughs> hi <laughs> My name is Callie. And he's just kind of staring at her like, oh my god, this girl is drunk drunk. <laughs> but she's like, oh my gosh, she's like really cute. There's, she swept in on that fast with their relationship so high already. She's wasted right now. And he's just like completely entertaining it. He's just like, yeah, you're, ah, uh, oh my gosh, she's so drunk. <laughs> he's like, yeah, yeah, I've met Molly. Um, I actually, I live here too. I can't believe how drunk she is. She's only had, what, two drinks? Molly's just sitting there like, oh my god, Callie, don't you dare ask to be woo partners. Uh, wait a second. 
I feel like Callie right now is like her her little mind is just like spinning. She doesn't really know <laughs> what to do. She's just being like overly touchy and like kind of flirty. Um she is absolutely wasted. Kaysen is like nowhere to be found, by the way. I don't know where he went. Um I he's just not here and she's just like, oh my gosh. Um, so, do you, like, come here often? <laughs> He's like, I, I, I live here. <laughs> She's, like, giving hugs and being, like, super duper, um, like, nice and talkative because he's cute. I wonder, like, how cute she thinks he is, actually. I'm, I'm a little curious. Extremely attractive. Like, she's very attracted to this man. <laughs> I want to say I... I didn't know that he would be her type so much, um, because she usually likes, um, guys with, like, darker features, like, black hair, like, bright eyes, you know, tall, dark, and handsome kind of, kind of stuff, you know, but this bright, beautiful person is very much her type, apparently. <laughs> she is gone though i think she's gonna head to sleep and um <laughs> she's so drunk look at her go home callie you're drunk yeah just sad for so seemingly no good reason whatsoever so she's sad she's drunk i think we're gonna head to bed and i'll see you in the morning the next morning and Callie has woke up and she is hung over. <laughs> she is super hung over from last night. She woke up at 5 a.m. for some reason. She definitely needs to go back to sleep. I don't think anyone is awake at this point. Oh, I guess there's some people awake. But she wants some coffee. She probably woke up because she feels sick. That's what happens to me anyway. So I'm going to, you know, uh, put that on her as well. Um... Also, so technically, um, Rylan is one of our roommates, but I can't seem to assign him a bed, so we'll see what happens with that. I'm not sure, um, what the deal is with that, but she's just gonna come grab some coffee really quick to see if it makes her feel any better. Um, add a little spice. No, you do not want spice when you're feeling hungover. She's just drinking coffee outside. This is... This is a mood. Um... Someone bring lobster? Thermidor? Okay. She's gonna grab some lobster thermidor since it's here. I mean, if I was hungover, I definitely wouldn't eat lobster th thermidor, but, you know, to each their own. Um. <laughs> Look at him cleaning up. They're so cute. Do I feel a little bit bad for her flirting with them last night while also dating Kaysen? Possibly. Do I feel that bad? No. <laughs> oh, cute. Like, Molly's like, oh my gosh, dude, that party last night was so much fun. <laughs> I didn't really see what Molly was up to. I know she was, like, really agitated looking. And you're just, you're still carrying around dirty dishes. You are such a little helpful angel. Um, but I feel like they're just like, well, they, they were talking. They are no longer speaking to one another. They're just staring at each other. Oh... Well, you. So I was going to end the episode the next morning, but it was the flea market, and I thought it would be a really fun thing to like go to with um, our new friends. Um, also, um, this outfit. Come on, please. Callie looks amazing. Sorry, I just <laughs> need to show off my girl a little. Um, but I feel like she feels a little bit bad for how drunk she was last night. So 
um, she's just gonna be like, oh, hey, I just wanted to tell you, like, I'm sorry. I was really drunk last night, and I wasn't myself, and I'm, like, so sorry that I came on to you so hard, and I am in a relationship, and, like, I... I'm just really sorry, like, I didn't mean to, um, get so hot and spicy with you. I'm sorry. And he's just like, oh, it's, it's fine. I could tell that you, you know, were a little under the influence, and I don't hold it against you at all. Um, I also want to say, Rylan is an art major, much like, um, Callie, so they're gonna have a lot of the same classes. Um... And like a lot of the same things. So, um, ooh, let's come get a new crest snow globe. Oh my gosh, these snow globes are phenomenal. I don't think I've ever seen this many snow globes. The Reaper snow globe, limited edition, absolutely. I've never seen this many snow globes. Skitty City Skyline, City Bridge. These are so cool. I mean that genuinely, by the way. I'm not just... Cool. Oh my gosh. Okay. I like your little dress. The shoes are a bit much, but... Honestly, I was hoping to find some, like, random little accessories or something here, but there does not seem to be any. Um... Let's maybe order some- it is, like, really hot for pho. I am completely aware of this. Okay, it is way too hot to order pho, but I want her to know how to make it, so we're gonna order it anyway. Um, but, I don't know, I was really hoping that there would be more, like, little stuff, um, for her to buy, but it doesn't seem that there is, which kind of sucks, but it's fine. Um, I don't even know where they and, um, oh, they're over here talking. Come join me or something. Oh my gosh, you guys. Don't take your laptop out. I freaking hate it when they do this. Ugh. I don't want other people using it. Put it away. Am I? Am I blind? You're gonna have to get over that whole spice thing, baby girl, because not in this household. We eat spice in this house. Put this in your inventory. And then... I think that before we go, it would be really cute if, um... You guys... I'm not sure where they went. If you guys worked on a mural together... Because I feel like this is something that um, her and Rylan would probably do if they like saw a little mural spot. I can also definitely see them going to the art museum together, which I think is going to be really fun. Molly, you don't have to join us if you don't want to, but I think I think she is anyway. Which is perfectly fine. But I just want them to just kind of have some fun and do a little painting together before they head home. Callie's just standing here. What are you doing, Callie? It was your idea. Help them with it. She's just busy staring at Rylan. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. She's just like, she has the fattest crush <laughs> on this person. <laughs> It's so funny. Molly's like, oh gosh, I'm gonna intercept. I'm gonna talk over. Oh my, oh my gosh, why are you so mad, Molly? You're not even helping, Callie. Help with the mural, please. She just stood there for most of it. Oh, 
You know what, honestly, I feel like I'm just gonna spend so much time just admiring Rylan because they're so frickin' beautiful. <laughs> Gosh. Wish her eyes were open. Jeez. She's so cute! Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I'm glad that Molly joined us, though. These two artists, and she's just like, yeah, sure, I can help out. They keep getting confused. I have i don't think I've ever painted a mural with other sims before. It's always been me doing it, and they're doing it on such a hot day. Ooh, there's a creativity celebration going on right now. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. <laughs> Molly's like, don't do that to me, bro. <laughs> oh, look at Catley desperate for a like a little pee. Um we'll be right back. And with that, we're back at school. She's painting another um. Oh my gosh. Hold on. I was about to end the episode. Oh. Um. So here's, here's the problem. Um, I would say yes, typically, but I think I'm going to say you should really decide for yourself. I think this is very cute, but there is some stuff going on. Um, in the background between these two that happened while I was playing off camera with and it's on Eric, by the way. Um I'm gonna say you should really decide for yourself for now. Um I don't think that Alyssa liked the fact that we told her no, but she's gonna have to learn to deal with it. Can you stop sh gyrating on me? <laughs> I can't get a good screenshot if you're gyrating in front of me. Move! <laughs> new new uh, picture is gonna be Callie making out with the mascot. Well, with that, I think we're going to finish up the episode here. That was a pretty long episode, and I feel like if I continue going, I'm just going to end up getting carried away. <laughs> so with that, I'm going to end up the, ep the episode right here. But thank you so much for watching, and I'm just so excited to go on this journey with Callie. And I think I'm going to go in, and by next episode, I should have most of the roommates with, like, simple makeovers. And yeah, I'll... See you guys in the next one. Bye.